Coach, uh, uh, Ian said uh, he was actually pretty displeased with, with his outing today. What did you see out of him? I, he competed, and uh, I thought we had a, a strike zone that was pretty tight, but it was consistent, you know. Um, but that's Ian. He's going to, he's going to think, I mean, he's always going to believe he can pitch better. And I thought he kept us in the game good, and we were able to score some runs for him. And uh, so, yeah, I mean, if he's wanting more, perfect. I'll take more. I'll take no runs next week. But uh, I was happy with the, with the whole thing. A lot of walks, a lot of action on the base pass. Was, was this what you want to see out of Marty Lee's offensive baseball? Absolutely. It's exactly what I want to see. Uh, we talked a lot about the pitches that we moved on early yesterday, and we were not going to do that. And today we did not do that. We forced some action once we were able to see some pitches. Um, I thought we had great execution from from virtually everybody. Um, Jimmy Thinney came up big with a slash when people were crashing. Um, executed a, a safety squeeze. Um, we were able to move runners up. Cirillo's been having a hot bat right now and been able to get a steal. Uh, we have runners at second, third for him to knock into. It's exactly the way that we want to play and that we need to play. We need to be able to force action, and we had the base runners to do it tonight, and some guys came in hey. big with uh, with hits when we need them. Jacob Thurber, you know, um, probably kicking my tail right now for not pulling him a little bit earlier and, and making sure that he got some uh, ABs, but I'm very impressed with his ABs and what he's done the last two days. Very excited for him. Some, some that I think you addressed uh, in the fourth inning, uh, you bunted with Matheny, his first time up. Yeah. First, Trey, second, nobody Trey. out yep. in the fourth inning, and you decided to keep the hand, the, the bat in Matheny's hands. What did you see there? The. In the fourth inning. Yeah, it was one, there was one out. Okay. Yeah, there was one out, and I wanted to move guys to second and third um, to give, uh, you know, I want to get Shane going a little bit. And I want to make sure that uh, he stays with us. And we've got the top of the order uh, coming up. And Trex also got a, a hot bat. So um, that's what we tried to do and um, work later in the game. But, uh, you know, we're going to try and press as much as we can and put kids in, in the best situation possible. You don't see so many young guys dig their heels in and get four walks in a game like uh, like Justin did today. Yeah, that was big for Justin. It's something that we, we addressed uh, as a group earlier today, um, that if we just stay, you know, he, he's antsy. He wants to swing. He wants to be aggressive. And I want him to, too. And that's the thing I don't want to take out of their hands, but at the same time, we need to be a little bit smarter with it. And today he saw did a really good job of laying off some really tough pitches. So, Did you kind of adjust the team with kind of like a team meeting side of the game last night, given the offense about and then having today be so much different? Was there kind of we, yeah, we didn't talk last night. I uh, sent him home. We, and we talked about it today when I was a little bit, could think about it a little bit more, and uh, they weren't in a position that they wanted to listen to me, and, uh, and I didn't want to talk to them either. So we met earlier today, and uh, we spent about 45 minutes talking about what we're going to do and how we're going to do it. And um, uh, it was exactly to a T. And it starts on the mound. We told him it starts on the mound. Ian gave us a great outing. And I liked the way we responded. We gave up a run, but we responded by getting a run. Um, got a couple early that were um, just how you do it. You bunt them over, you hit them in, you, you compete, you do those things. We have a chance to, to do just what we did tonight.